the weather now. Some folks in California are cleaning up after two days of heavy rain and flooding. Strong winds pushed waves ashore, knocking a tree into a house near Sacramento and slamming rocks into a street near San Diego. As Jonathan Vigliotti reports, officials are worried that the storm damage is still mounting. The latest atmospheric river storm drove high waves onto the beach in Southern California Tuesday. The waves are pretty wild. Pushing rocks and other debris past the shoreline where crews worked to clear roads in Oceanside. In San Francisco, some residents were trying to clear storm drains in knee deep flooding. If no one does it, the whole intersection is just going to continue to flood. So someone's got to do it. Load is on. Positive rate of climb. The relentless rainfall drenching the state led to this rescue of two drivers trapped in rising floodwaters, hoisted to safety by California Highway Patrol. It's also causing previously unseen levels of land movement, putting homes and neighborhoods in disrepair. I've seen the road change daily. Cracks that you didn't see before suddenly you know, are, are, are appearing. The coastal city of Rancho Palos Verdes has seen the ground shift up to 10 feet in just one year. You've lived in Southern California your whole life? Yeah. Uh, does it scare you? Do, do you worry? I, I do. And this morning, this is what residents are most worried about. This home has sunk several feet. The street behind me has buckled. The soil here is so saturated, it's kind of like quicksand. And this morning, officials saying at least 400 other homes are currently threatened, Gail. Oh, boy, that's very scary stuff. Thank you very much, Jonathan.